Hello everybody, and welcome back to another J.A. Diecast review. For today's review, we have Chase Elliott's 2016 uh, Rookie of the Year car. Um, so pretty much just his primary paint scheme with the Rookie of the Year logo on the roof, as well as a Galaxy finish. Uh, I don't think, I'm pretty sure Galaxy was the only uh, finish that the Rookie of the Year cars are made in, or at least for this one. Um, could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. Uh, but before we get too far into it, just want to say thank you guys for watching. Uh, it means a lot. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and check out the links down below. There is an active giveaway on my Instagram, so check out the link for that, and uh, good luck. And there will be... Uh, I think I'm going to do a giveaway like every 100 followers or something like that. I don't know. I'm going to be doing it more often. Uh, just try and be more... Uh, kind Not really inclusive, but uh, kind of... I don't want to say give back, but just do do more stuff for uh, you know my followers and subscribers. Um, just kind of do something like that. So check that out. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. And uh, let's get into it. Starting with the winner card. Uh, so we got Chase Elliott, 2016 NASCAR Sprint Cup Series Rookie of the Year. Uh, and his 2016 stats are as follows. Uh, 36 starts, 2 pole awards, uh, 358 laps led. Top 5 finishes, he had 10 of them. Uh, 17 top 10 finishes. His average starting position was 11.3. And his average finish was 14.6. He did not win in his rookie year, uh, but use her... Or, Saw, heard the top uh, f 10 top 5 finishes. I think 3 of them were 3rd and 2 of them were 2nd. Both of the 2nd places were at Michigan. And given how that season went, I'm pretty sure he finished 2nd at Michigan a couple more times. Um, he's got, what, 7 Cup Series wins now? I'm surprised he hasn't won at Michigan yet, uh, considering how close he came a lot of times. Uh, for the back of this card... You got Chase Elliott proves he has what it takes. Uh, it didn't take long for Chase Elliott to make his mark on the NASCAR Sprint Cup Series. Elliott started his first full season in the series off with a bang, capturing the pole for the season opening Daytona 500, and he didn't let up for the rest of the year. By season's end, the Georgia native has easily staked his claim on the Sunoco Rookie of the Year award. As a rookie, Elliott qualified for the 2016 chase for the NASCAR Sprint Cup and finished with 10 top 5s, 17 top 10s, and 2 poles. After climbing as high as 6th in the point standings during the season, he finished 10th overall. His success on the track paved an easy path to earning the Sunoco Rookie of the Year honors. I think it was a mix of that and not really having any competition. Um, pretty sure Chris Buescher was, if not the only rookie, one of like only two others, if that. Uh, and Busher also won in his rookie year, if I'm not mistaken. Might have been 2017, but Busher won early on at Pocono uh, due to a, a weather-shortened race where it wasn't even raining. It was just fog. Uh, but not taking it away from him. I like Chris Busher. Great guy. Um, but back to this. Here's the box. Just Chase Elliott. You got uh, Chase Elliott, number 24, Napa Rookie of the Year, 2016 SS Galaxy Color. And one of 624. Out of those 624, I have number 354. So, let's take a look at it here. As you can see, it's kind of sparkly. That is what the Galaxy Finish is. It's like a... It's like a contrasted blue and the sparkles. We'll get into it here. Uh, but there's the full left side. Let's kind of go down Moog. Melee, Conk Cams, Edelbrook, Sunoco, uh, NASCAR Race Car, Mechanics Wear, 3M, NASCAR Sprint Cup Series, 21, Flowmaster, Ingersoll Rand, and Sunoco Rookie Contender, Chase Elliott, Hendrick, Exalta, Bosch, Freightliner, Mac Tools, and Siemens, Mountain Dew, and BeTheMatch.org, Kelly Blue Book, Valvoline, Napa Auto Parts, American Ethanol, and Sun Energy One. And there's a better look at the uh, color in the sparkle. It's almost gray, but not quite. Still can see the blue, but it's almost gray. Um, 
here is the right side. This is pretty much just his 2016 primary uh, with a different finish and the Rookie of the Year logo on the roof, which we'll look at in a minute. There's the nose, the hood, Elliot, and here I'll show the roof. There's an overhead view, and there is the NASCAR 2016 Sunoco Rookie of the Year. We'll take a look at the back. Napa know-how, Valvoline 24, and Napa Auto Parts. But that'll just about do it for this one. Uh, pretty quick. Uh, just, like I said, just the same things as primary, but different finish and uh, the logo for the Rookie of the Year on the roof. But I do hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Check out the links down below. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.